give back. So, when I first came to the UK as well, you know, I just came with one backpack and one suitcase. And I remember how kind the English people were, well, I'd say English, the British people were, because there were a lot of Scottish and were Welsh as well, and were Irish as well, but they were very, very kind. Like, and, and, and I remember, and, you know, when I was uh, first starting to live on my own, and my, my friend from Wales would just give me pots and plates because I didn't have anything to just to start off with. And uh, even in college, you know, they were very, very kind to just give um, their time to help a foreign student. So I was very, very appreciative and I never ever underestimated the whole power of kindness and uh, of giving back. So it is very, very important that we give back whatever professions we are doing. We can always give back, whether in terms of time, effort, money, we can give back. Because there's a big difference, big difference between achievement and fulfillment. So achievement is when you become a vet, when you get a degree, when you are running in sports and you get your gold medal, you get a silver medal. Those are achievements. You have it. And nobody can take it away from you. However, that doesn't translate to fulfillment. Fulfillment usually happens when you are doing something for somebody else. So achievement is when you're doing things for yourself. Fulfillment is when you're doing things for somebody else. So the chief fulfillment you have to give up. It's not how much money you have, it's not what you've accumulated, it's not what degrees you have, it's how much you've given up. The chief fulfillment. So this are my six little lessons that I wanted to share. <coughs> my stories that some of them never mind. Um, and uh, I guess I uh, would truly wish you know, all of us, you, to get as much out from this weekend as possible and actually change how we do things. Change your thinking, change your behavior, change your results.